Alright guys, this is Squid996 and I'm bringing you today an all new commentary. Uh, it's called How Not To Suck At FIFA. I'm going to be basically telling you some tips of the game, hopefully to convert you from a boring player to one with a bit of excitement, skills, long shots. One that can score some pretty good goals and play well, win matches. I'm going to start off talking about midfield and one rule is, if you don't shoot, you don't score. So from any angle or any range, remember if you don't shoot, you're not going to score. Also in midfield, try not to do too much skills with your midfield plays because if you lose it, then you're pretty open for attack because you've only got the defence at the back. If you're in attack, then you've maybe got a bit more room with your midfield plays that they have to get past. But yeah, one main rule is you don't shoot, you don't score. In defence, if you try not to sprint around too much, this will really knock your players out by the end of the match and also it will be easier for them to take it past you. One button that is really good to use is L2, well, for PS3. This makes sure your player jockey, the other player, so basically the holding the ground makes it harder for the opponents to get past, as an example, and it's a lot easier to defend with. When slide tackling, slide in, try to slide in front of the player because even if you miss, you might like me not to give away a foul or get a card or something. And when you do get the ball in defence, try to break down the wings quicker because they're going to be open there. There'll be more space to run into. And if you can, try play the 1-2 maybe. Because this will draw your player in and give room behind the back to run into. But when you're running, try not to do too much. I think I should have shot here. But, you know, I got a bit carried away. Try to do too much. And there you go, that's what happens. Right, when talking about attack, the best way to score goals is to try and run it down and finesse. The finesse in the uh, shot rate is probably a lot more, lot higher to go in when you're finessing. Even then, like driving it. This is probably because it's easier to score, just curling it around the keeper. Also, don't try to do too much skill. I know I do a bit, but yeah. Free kicks. One major... One, well, great free kick to use is the dipping free kick. Um, I could post a tutorial on this, comment on how you want, but the main thing is hold L3 up, which is the left analog stick when shooting. Try to hit it within about two and a half bars, and it will dip. Uh, using the driven free kick, you hold L1 down, and I would say get it to just about the orange mark on the power bar, and this will... You can add curl, but when you're adding curl, try not to add as much when doing that driven free kick because it's not going to curl as much with the power on it. There's a nice little free kick at the end. Alright, bringing this to an end. I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you'll take these tips away to use in the real game. And uh, please get back to me. Uh, please rate, like, comment, and please subscribe to our channels for a lot, lot more. Cheers.